Hey guys, it's Adam E.K. Swimming Bird, and welcome to Animal Crossing New Leaf. Today we are dressed as dreaded pirate Davy Bones, scourge of Goost and Sea, ruling over the waters just outside the little safety floaties where you're not supposed to swim past. I terrorize Tortimer Island, battling my arch enemy, Captain Cap'n. But anyways, let's check the mail and get to some mayor duties today. We got a letter from Pinky with a package, okay. Maybe she moved? I don't think she did. Yep, she's still there. All right, so she didn't send me her picture, but she might have sent me something good. Let's see. Hi there, Adam. Something special is in store for you today. A lucky item I picked out just for you. Now, you'll have a happy day for sure, because you're getting a gift from me. Love ya, from Pinky. All right, had to remember Pinky's voice there. We haven't talked to her in a while. She might leave sometime. A seven ball tea. Okay, let's see what this one looks like. Oh, it's kind of a nice bad brown color. It's not horrible, but I'm going to stick with my captain's coat here. All right, so let's look around and uh, see what's going on in Goostin. Step on some crunchy leaves on the way. I want to start a new public works project, and I don't remember which ones I have as options, but I might do the Moai head, because we just got that one last time. Let's talk to Coco here. Good morning. Looks like the beginning of another beautiful day. Doing. So what can I do for you? What's the latest, Coco? I've taken up calligraphy. Recently, but to make it more of a challenge, I do it on tissue paper. I can't begin to describe how good it feels to finish a letter without tearing the paper. Okay. <laughs> Gonna leave her alone. There's Brofina. How you doing? Amantis said hello. He was actually afraid of me and was gonna try to attack, so we're not gonna bother him. I don't see, there's nobody in the plaza. Let me see if I can peep the campsite and uh, see if anyone's camping. Doesn't look like it. It's kind of hard to see from this, uh, this angle. I didn't put the campsite in a very good area. I wanted it to kind of be on its own, like its own little park, but because it's like on that little peninsula there, it's tough to tell if somebody's camping unless I go all the way around past Cooper's place. But we can ask Copper what's going on. There's a lot of uh, t-shirts and seeds in the office here. What's going on, buddy? What's new? I hear Sahara is in town. I believe she's out selling wallpaper and carpeting. All right, maybe we'll talk to her. I could use some. The, uh, the carpet that I have in my house is actually like a moss carpeting that Sahara gave me not too long ago. So I usually uh, keep the same carpet and wallpaper in the rooms if I find one that I like. But the fact that she did give me one that I ended up liking more than the tatami that I had it was kind of cool. I should uh, talk to her more often, because some of the ones that she does give you are exclusive, and you can only get them through her. It sounds like the hour is changing. I was going to go inside to show you guys, because I actually have a Moai inside my house. I was just thinking about making the Moai head, but I have one in the corner of my house. So this is the uh, moss carpet that I've got here, and you can see I put out my pagoda, and I put out my little water bird here. He's going up and down, drinking from my soft-shelled turtle's tank. Yeah, the, the hour did just change. There's the Moai head back in the corner here with some of my other worldly items. But yeah, he's uh, he's looking cool. I wonder if the Public Works one will look similar. We'll have to find out. I can't remember what our last Public Works project it was. It was uh, quite a while ago, if I remember. We, we have the like stone tablet, and we have Isabel's bathroom over here, which is very important. Probably the most important Public Works project here. I don't want to touch it, but it's there. And uh, it's her executive bathroom. But a few of the other ones are just more actual, like, uses, like the police station and the roost. So I'm going to see what else we got here in terms of options. We also have the lighthouse, but I like ones that are functional, but I think we've, we've done most of those. Hi, Mayor Adam. Is there something I can help you with? We want to check out the public works projects. We want to work on a public works project. I'm happy to help. What would you like to work on? All right, let's start a new project here. Here are the current requests from the townspeople. So we've got, we could change the town hall to a bunch of different themes, but I've got the good, I've got the Japanese one that I like. Let's see, cobblestone bridge, suspension bridge, modern bridge, lots of different types of bridges there. I like the one, there's a bench that you can get that's like logs, that looks, it's just a single log that you can sit on. I really want that one. And uh, Danielle has that in, in uh, Sparkles. She hasn't built one yet, but she's got the option. Pile of pipes, a fountain, some street lights, a balloon arch, nothing I'm too interested in really here. Lots of different types of signs, a cube sculpture, Crazy archway that looks like a dinosaur bone. There's a lot of modern art in my public works options here. And uh, that crazy tower that looks like Tokyo Tower. There's the Moai. It's a little different from the one... Jeez, that is expensive. It's a little different from the one that uh, is in my house. So let's do that one. Would you like to start work on the Moai statue project? Let's do it. 
We're gonna put the town's funds to good use to make this pretty much useless Moai head that's awesome looking. Yay, let's go find a place to build. I wonder if it's super expensive because there's like a ton underneath, like the body is gonna be down in the ground, but I'm, I'm really jealous of, uh, of Sparkles. We're gonna lead the way because Danielle managed to get some really cool public works projects. She's got a scarecrow that she can build, a Zen bell. I can't remember what else. She has quite a few different things. Isabel's just pushing past Graham. Get out of my way! <laughs> she dragged him across the bridge. <laughs> okay, so I want to try to do the Moai somewhere close to the beach, maybe along the shore here. I think this was around where Genji used to live. Like, maybe we could put it right here in the middle of the dirt. Probably look kind of cool there. But I want to weigh my options real quick. We're just going to head along the coast. Could we do it on... We could do it outside of her house right here, because this would uh, it would be kind of go with uh, Coco's cabana. Her little cabana stylings there. Let me see. Oh, oh, what's the matter, Mayor? Let's finish our work first. We can't go down to the beach? Okay. I was going to say, if we could build the Moai head on the beach, that would be awesome. She's like, let's finish our work, and then we can go to the island and hang out. You never go to the island, Isabella. I always want you to go with me, but you never do. That's the stone tablet there. It doesn't really look like a tablet. It just kind of looks like a rock that somebody scratched a few things into. And here's our lighthouse. So maybe, yeah, I think we can honor Genji with a stoic Moai statue for a stoic-faced little zen bunny. And uh, I was going to build like a zen garden over his house, but I don't know if we're going to get that anytime soon. So I think the Moai head would be cool. And it'll be along the beach, right here. And then it'll kind of make this dirt patch that'll never go away be a little bit more interesting looking. I think it's where I stand, so let me try it right here. Yes, Mayor? This is about where you'd like to place the Moai statue? What do you think? Well, let's see. I think this would be perfect. I'll need to remove the plants and anything buried underground. But if that's okay with you, the spot is fine. Probably looks something like this when it's finished. Is she gonna get rid of the bamboo? Oh, I wanna kinda put it a little closer than that. No, I gotta think this over. We're gonna go a little closer if I can. Let me try it here. Uh, it's kind of, the bamboo is kinda like right where I want it to be. So I'm gonna dig this bamboo up. I'm sorry, Genji. Your memory will live on in the uh, playlist with the other videos. Okay, let me see if I can get her to walk over and I wanna do it right here. Let's place it right there. All right, what do you think, Isabel? Will it fit? I'm sure it will. We're not too close. And it's slightly off-center. I want it to be right where she is standing, but a little over. I'm gonna nudge her slightly to the side. Okay, Isabel, stand right there. Just, that's perfect. Okay, don't move, Isabel. Freeze, sit. <laughs> We're gonna give her, we gotta give her a treat. I don't have any, I have some fossils. Maybe, is she like, she's a dog. Maybe she'd like bones. But I gotta give her a treat to, uh, oh man, it's like off-center. But I don't think I can get it any more centered than that. We'll try one more time. I'm gonna try to push her over even farther over here, and I'm gonna stand like here. And let's see. I I, I wonder if the the way the grid works in the town, it's gonna always be off center. So let's see. Will it be right in the middle? That's fine. We can have a little bit of dirt on the side. Let's do it. Good enough by me. Okay. It will bother me forever that it's slightly off, but it's okay. Understood. Well, let's go ahead and start the needed preparations. I can always demolish it if I really feel like it, but that's a lot of bells. It's like half a million. All set. To help us gather donations to fund the Moai statue is our helpful town gyroid, Lloyd. It's going to be hard to wait for all the donations to arrive, so we have our Moai statue. Well, I must return to the town hall. Right, you don't need to worry about making the trip back, Mayor. Okay, then. I'll be taking my leave. But we, we were going to go to the island. Isabel! <laughs> we were going to go and play on the beach and pick shells and fall in love. No. She's my assistant. We have a work relationship, so we're going to keep it at that. Let me see. Sahara's supposed to be uh, trotting around here somewhere, but I don't know. There's Coco again. She's fishing? I'll leave her be. She's really enjoying the uh, the natural pursuits of Gustin. I think we're coming up on another fishing... We just did a fishing tournament, but I thought there was a bunch of them in the fall. So maybe we'll have another one, I think. Nope. I thought that was uh, Sahara, but it's Cranston. What's up, buddy? You might not know this, but I've been on the hunt for a sweet seven ball tea. And I couldn't help but notice that you have one. Would you mind selling it to me? Sure. How much you want? <laughs> well, how does 85 bells sound? What? It's a deal. I don't want it. <laughs> Just take it. Just take it. Sweet. I love making a deal. So I'll be taking that for 85 bells, okay? New rules. Is he going to put it on right here? Also, what is that bug behind the tree watching us? There's a grasshopper eavesdropping on our business deal. Okay, he's leaving. I made him nervous. He made me really happy. Thanks, new rules. There he goes. That actually looks pretty good on him. I like the... The contrast of the uh, brown and the, the the white of his ruffled feathers. He looks really nice there. I wanted to find Sahara before we finish out here. 
Cooper's got a lot of mail. Gotta tell him about that. We got a campsite with nobody in it. There she is! Haha! -ha. I found ya! What's up, Sahara? I am called Sahara, for that is my name. I come from faraway land. I have many wallpapers for the papering of walls, many carpets for the petty of cars. For 3,000 bells, deal? Deal! Let's go back! Ah, it is nice. Let us travel to your place swiftly. Come on, don't step on that! Okay, jeez. <laughs> She's got her giant camel feet. She, uh... She doesn't seem to have any hump. I wonder if her uh, her backpack is supposed to be like her hump, because she doesn't have a big like hump on her back. Or else that backpack would be like raised a few uh, feet from where it is <laughs> off of her. All right, here we go. I don't. I I feel like I need to uh, do some landscaping. Danielle has really been making sparkles beautiful. She's been on a a mission to put flowers all over the place and do public works and things like that. So she uh, she's making the place look great, and I feel like I need to step up my game and make Gustin a bit, little bit nicer. I also want to organize my house a bit more because these rooms they're just pretty much cluttered. Like in like in real life, they're just cluttered with stuff that I like, and uh, they need to be a little tidier. All right, let's see what Sahara has in store. It's probably going to be like space floor with cheese walls or something that doesn't go together at all. But I trust her. It feels like she's breaking everything I own and some type of crazy magic happened, but <laughs> but I trust her, her design sense. It is done. Done like the past. Tomorrow is here. The future needs not this, so you must take it. Oh, I hopefully I, I do have room for that. Okay. Thank you. Uh, my vision. It will grow on you. Like a stray hair. Pluck it, you must not. Okay. So, I guess she wants us to leave her carpet and wallpaper as it is. She's gone. She's getting away with the three... She's running with the 3,000 bells before I can complain. What do we got? Ugh. I don't know about this. The tile's kind of weird. The wall, they seem like they match a little bit. I don't know. Let's see what these are called. I'm going to I'm gonna put back on my moss carpet and my modern screen. That was the blue trim wall and the kitchen tile. I don't know. This isn't a kitchen. We got like a crazy zen garden going on or the pond and my samurai armor. But, okay. At least I have this stuff. <laughs> they might be exclusive. I don't know. Thank you guys for watching. Before we end out, I wanted to show you something I made. I found the meaning of life upstairs in my house, and here it is, my special lamps from Wispy. Thanks for watching guys, please leave a like if you enjoyed this, and I will see you next time for some more Animal Crossing New Leaf. Goodbye.